What do we got here tonight? These flicks will make you giggle and scream. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our top 10 favorite horror-themed comedies. Number 10, Tucker and Dale vs. Evil. Kicking off our list is the tale of two lovable hillbillies. All Tucker and Dale want to do is enjoy their new vacation home. But a series of misunderstandings cause a group of vacationing college teens to mistake them for psychopathic serial killers. <laughs> this film reverses all the slasher genre's greatest cliches and stereotypes without turning down the gore. How's Evil walking right now, Tuck? He looks like he's going to walk it off. He's going to be fine. <sighs> Number 9, Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. Imagine that, a film where the tomatoes turn you into ketchup. This low-budget cult horror comedy musical is definitely a one-of-a-kind experience. Known as the best worst movie ever made, it spoofs everything you ever loved about creature features and will make you laugh with its absurd premise and awful, awful acting. Now, if you'll excuse me, I think I'll be on my way. Number 8, Dead Alive, also known as Brain Dead. Before he adapted the works of J.R.R. Tolkien, Peter Jackson gave us a cartoonish and incredibly over the top splatterfest. Your mother ate my dog! Not all of it. A village idiot tries to hide his mother's zombification and subsequent infection spree following a bite from a Sumatran rat monkey. Eventually, he's forced to deal with the problem the only way he knows how by mowing the lawn. Well, sort of. Party's over. This movie delivers some of the most outrageous scenes and one-liners ever put to film. Number 7, Scary Movie. Brought to you by the deranged minds of the Wayans brothers, this horror parody pretty much copies the events of Scream and I Know What You Did Last Summer verbatim. A seriously raunchy teen horror comedy, it reminds us why we like scary movies so much. And just like the films it spoofs, it's all about the shock value. What would have been your last words to Drew? Run, bitch! Run! Number 6, Gremlins. Gizmo is the cutest little mogwai ever. Just don't break the three rules, like exposing him to bright light, getting him wet, or feeding him after midnight. But of course, the rules do get broken, and that creates a batch of evil gremlins. These ravenous and impulsive killing machines enjoy a wide range of activities, like launching handicapped women through windows and watching Snow White and the Seven Dwarves. What are they doing? I'm watching Snow White. Number five, Zombieland. Hey, a zombie movie with brains. This post-apocalyptic road trip flick is centered on a group of unlikely survivors looking for a safe haven in the Midwest. What we get are outrageous survival rules, a twinkie crazed Woody Harrelson, I hate coconut, not the taste, the consistency. A zombie clown and a hilarious Bill Murray cameo that would make any Ghostbusters fan giddy. God damn it, Bill Murray! Number four, Beetlejuice. What do you think of this? You like it? When a couple loses their lives in a freak car accident, they discover that the afterlife is one big bureaucracy and that they're stuck haunting their home. Even worse, the new owners are total lunatics. This causes them to enlist the service of a wild and uncontrollable bio-exorcist who likes it when you call his name three times. This Tim Burton creation mixes his grotesque style with genuine scares and laughs. Number 3, Sean of the Dead. Sean is a deadbeat who would rather hang out at the pub with his loser best friend than make his girlfriend happy. When he gets caught playing hero during a sudden zombie apocalypse, all of his plans involve taking her to the bar where he can drink and wait for the crisis to blow over. If we hole up, I want to be somewhere familiar, I want to know where the exits are, and I want to be allowed to smoke. This zombie romp not only revived its genre, but also remains its funniest entry to date. <laughs> Number 2, Ghostbusters. This is arguably one of the funniest movies of all time. It features some of the best group chemistry ever recorded. Stop that! Countless tongue-in-cheek moments. Sounds like you got at least two people in there already. And simply oozes with charm. What other supernatural flick would feature a 100-foot marshmallow man, let alone call it the Destroyer? Well, there's something you don't see every day. Plus, you have to admit that the librarian ghost scared the crap out of you too. 
Number one, Army of Darkness. Lady, I'm afraid I'm going to have to ask you to leave the store. The third in the Evil Dead trilogy, this time travel sequel is equal parts swords and sorcery. Plus, it features hilarious one-liners Give me some sugar, baby. and tons of outrageousness. Bruce Campbell is a B-movie legend for a reason, and this is it. Hail to the king, baby. Do you agree or disagree with our list? Which horror-themed comedy is your favorite? Don't forget to check us out at WatchMojo.com for other exciting top tens. We came, we saw, we kicked its ass!